Welcome back. So it's Git Tech uh, 55 now, and let's uh, start actually making, adding some kind of um, image cropper here. That's actually the goal of this lesson to get an image cropper into our uh, UI. So what I'm going to do? Well, I have this awesome image cropper right here, um, Angular 2 image cropper, and it's actually now signed up for Angular 4. So that's an Angular 2 image cropper for Angular 4. Doesn't matter. npm install ng2 image cropper let's do it so i'm opening a tab here i'm just going to install that new image cropper that i want while that runs let's just have a look at it it's going to end up looking something like this you can choose a file select an area and then you can stop by and and say you want to keep that image and then it'll store it that's kind of the goal now to do this first of all we need to get image cropper component into the declaration so let's go into our code here that seems to be done and into, in my code, I'm going to add inside the app module, I'm going to add a new declaration. So we have declarations here and let me just add the image cropper and import it. There we go. Now we have image cropper component ready. And what else do we need? Well, we need to add this image cropper right here. The other part he's showing here is actually adding the, the presentation of the actual image. But since we already have that in our view where we're going to click this to change the image around, we don't want that right now. So let's, um, for now, just go in and add this code inside our user's profile. So I'm going to add this inside the beautiful content that I built uh, last lesson for actually showing the image. Now we don't have data and we don't have proper settings yet, so let, add, let's add those two as well. Going back here into my uh, example here, and I'm going to grab the crubber and the data so that we can start showing that as well inside the app component. I'm just showing his, his example here so you guys can go and read it in details if you want to and inside the profile image I'm going to add those two um, new pieces here data and cropper settings this is inside my profile component CSS file or sorry TS file now I'm going to add this as well where I just initialize the data and set some basic stuff for the canvas so that I can show the cropper image up front here and it's inside the constructor so let me just paste that in here there we go. Now I've set up the cropper and I've added the actual image here. So let's see if that actually works. It shouldn't be anything else than that, actually. Let's see what happens. Now I've experienced some problems with the animations after I actually made the change to Angular 2. If you experience this the same, I really don't know what to tell you. It should work, but it doesn't seem to all the time. So I've grabbed an image and it looks something like this now. Let's just find one here. There we go. And now I want to press the save button, but something's wrong because it's showing this, but not the actual change image like it should. So we need to figure this out. Going back to the code. Um, what did we do wrong? Oh, we didn't put this inside the div like we were supposed to. There we go. Going back. Now it's here. So now we have the image uh, choose available. So again, now all we need is make the save button work. We'll do that in the next lesson. See you next time.